This video may not be appropriate for children of 13 and under. Parental discretion is advised. Tired of missing out on figures or paying scalper prices at toy stores? Then go ahead and visit DJC Collectibles, my sponsor. You can get 10% on anything Transformers, accumulate points, and sometimes score an exclusive figure you thought you'd miss forever. Head over to DJC Collectibles and start saving today. Hi everyone, my name is Raziel Kane. I'm back with another tour review, and today, something a little different, we received this box. The DNA Design uh, Legacy Dinosaur Combiner Upgrade Kit. And this is my first official DNA Design Upgrade Kit. And it's for the Core Class Legacy Dinobot. Which we have right here. So these are the original uh, uh, accessories with the... Uh, uh, but they're the Toy Hacks version. I, uh, like I got the Toy Hacks kit. And my Core Class Dinobot video was popular. My Toy Hacks Core Class Dinobot uh, video was popular. Uh, so, not gonna lie, I'm hoping this is catching on because uh, DNA Design did a really nice set. So we're gonna open it. Let's go out. You have the box. You have all the, uh, you know, render for what's inside. I'm gonna set that aside and sorry you know it's a different setup because I'm doing this with my son who doesn't speak a word of English so he's gonna try to remain quiet but then he's gonna take over eventually and tell me what I'm doing wrong and you know it's fun so you have the uh, DNA design upgrade kit I'm gonna open that up and I'm not seeing the instructions Assembly instructions, so they tell you exactly what accessory is for who, what it does. So pause for the cause, zoom in, and we're going to follow these instructions to the letter and upgrade the uh, Dinobots. So that's cool. So we're going to put that here. I'm going to open this up. I'm trying to not snap everything so that they fly everywhere. Alright. So we have some... What do you want to show? The glue. The glue. The glue. Is it like this? So you give them and I'll show you on the camera. So we have some feet. They're going to look awesome on Volcanicus. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, some sort of crotch piece. These are new pieces for Grimlock and uh, with movable arms. So that's cool. And a good thing because my son broke his. Just one arm flew off. We have new hands which are uh, really well done. Uh, five finger articulation individual it's only one joint uh, at uh, well, it's not really uh, there you go so you have one joint but uh, all five fingers move and then you have a hole here to uh, hold uh, the sword I believe so you have two of those you have the beautiful swords Nicely detailed, the translucent. Uh, they're identical, and I don't know if they combine. We'll find that out uh, during assembly. But uh, it looks really good. And my background, I should have put a white uh, whiteboard uh, behind us. But we're trying something different. So there's a little piece like that. Those are probably gap fillers. You have another one here. You have this here. And then you have two more. Like this. So these are gap fillers. Okay. So we had lost this, but we found it. So there's an extra little gap. And then, okay, let's flip this around gently. Whoa. Pick, pick that up. Alright. So we have, I don't know which gun is the which, but we have six guns. 
which are nicely detailed. I'm going to show it like that so that you guys can get a better view. Wait, no more there. We have one like this. Uh, I can't get too close or else it blurs out. So, yeah. Another one like that. Yeah, no, we're doing guns first. On fait les diffuser en premier. So there you go. And now the swords. This, I don't know which one is which for now, but uh, you have the six swords. I'm guessing each Dinobot gets one, but I might be wrong. That, this is, I know this is smooth. This, I'm not sure. Maybe Grimlock? I don't know. Or maybe Slag. Oh, this looks like another swoop. So maybe they don't get... Oh, and there's another one like that. So we have four different designs of swords. And looks like five guns. Nope. Four designs of guns. So we're gonna... Six. Six. No, no. Il y a six fusils, mais il y en a qui sont pareils. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. So it's going to be, uh, or five guns. No, there's two doubles. Yeah. So four designs of guns. All right, cool. So we're going to look at the instruction and then come back with each individual upgrade to eventually give you the full upgraded Volcanicus form. Like we'll show assembly and everything. So we just got to study this for a moment. Uh, so bear with us. We tried to do it on camera, but it, it was a little too flaky. It's not solid. This is the base mode or storage mode. So basically, the feet go on each side, you have the fists in the middle, uh, the crotch piece here, and then you plug the guns uh, all around, uh, the swords all around and the big swords, and see, it's it's not that solid, but I mean, it's, it's something you can do. Uh, it's in the instructions, so yeah. Okay, so we're going to keep uh, doing the uh, robot, so yeah, individual robot for now. Okay, so we're ready to do the individual upgrade. So we're going to start with Sludge. Okay, Sludge gets all the, uh, ga the, the gap filler for here and everything. So we're going to start with the little gap uh, filler. Uh, this It's too small to really show on camera, but we're going to install it. Uh, uh, let's uh, move the camera down a little bit so that people can almost see what we're doing. So these will cover the mushroom pegs. Oh, okay. So the mushroom peg, it's really small, so it's hard to show on camera this way. But you're going to take that and place it. Here. So now this is filled and after that you have these things which are going to go this way. Alright. There you go. Eh? C'est mieux ça? Regarde, il n'y a plus de trou. Oui, c'est bien mieux. Oh, oui. Pourquoi? No. I'm doing it backwards. So, there you go. So you have these. And then after that, you have in the back, you have two pieces. This and this. And... This one goes like this. Where? Okay, so there's a hole right there. And then you have the pin here. Not bad, eh? And then you have this, which is going to go over the mushroom peg. Uh... 
like this. So here, there we go. Cleans up real nice now. No more hollowness, but he still has those you know stupid legs. Uh, okay, and then he gets the two guns, which you can store in the back. So there's a peg, peg hole here, which will peg in the back here. So if you don't want uh, him holding the guns. There you go. This is fun. Right. There you go. Oh. So that's the upgrade. Okay. And of course, you can store uh, you know these uh, guns in Dino mode. Now we're gonna do Grimlock. So Grimlock, you have to remove. Uh, the, well, I'm guessing both sides, but they're only saying to do one, but we're going to do both. So, wow. So it's on a ball joint. So there you go. Ah, well, I just broke the piece. Hmm. Nicely done, Dad. There you go. See, I just cracked the joint here. Okay, so now we're going to take this piece here. Uh, this side. And clip it. All right. We're going to clip this. There you go. And this basically should give us a more stable or a more articulated uh, top piece. Uh, it's not closing right now, but I'm guessing that's because it's not fully transformed. Uh, hmm? Right. So there you go. That's what it's going to look like now. And then he has the little moving arms. Oh, that's cool. I wish they kind of kept the chrome, but we're going to live with that. And there's a way to remove this to store it inside the foot. So we're going to see how that goes. Okay. Oh, and he has uh, swords. Which you can store where? Oh, okay, well, when he's in dino mode, you can store it in uh, that slot here. Like this. So, it's something. But you can put it in his arm, his hands, sorry. Like this. And, well, let's uh, open him up again. It's really tight. I like that. The uh, the DNA design stuff, uh, it holds. So there you go. So now you have Grimlock with his little swords. And so? Okay. Okay, after that, Slag. That's, okay, Slag is getting swords, which you can store in Dino mode. That's pretty much it. So we're going to just put him... Equip him with the swords. And there you go. They look good. Atem so. I like that. Then you get guns for so Snarl gets guns. Like this. Oh man. I need a white background when I do these type of reviews. I like that. And then like Melisip as whoop. And Scar gets two guns like this. Well, that's pretty cool. 
and Swoop gets uh, two swords. Nicely done. Okay, so now we're ready. We're going to do the uh, Volcanicus upgrade. So we're going to assemble the Volcanicus and then upgrade him. Because uh, there's nothing... Right now there's nothing showing. Sorry, right now there's nothing showing that needs to be assembled for Volcanicus before. So it's all after stuff. So we're going to put Volcanicus together and get back to you guys with the upgrades. Was it? Non, tout le monde qui était capable de le faire. Il fallait pas. Non, regarde. Swoop, il est là. Yeah, we're good. Ok, fait que là. Non, regarde. Là, Swoop. Swoop, il est. En est ce ça. moment, il est là. C'est ça. Swoop, là. Swoop, là. Mm. Ok. Parce que okay. quand je le vois à l'envers. Quand je le vois comme. See how he talks to me? All the time. Ok. So now. It's, well, it's, okay, this leg. Uh, and it's the other way around. So we you do it like this. And then you take this hand and put it like this. Oh, there you go. Okay. And this rotates. This is actually really cool. Okay. So you have a better hand. Okay. Now. No, why me this a bit cool so. Okay, then you have to split the legs. There's a hole inside underneath the mushroom peg and then you put these slots inside there. We have to rotate the legs. Aha. Okay, so we have to you have to really keep him in uh, in dyno mode on the back. So that the legs are in the back and then the hand alright there you go. So the legs are in the back, you have the, 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 the forearm and then the hand. So there you go. So that's actually just just that man looks way better. I like that. Okay, next. So you take the old fist, put this spin inside the hand like this to create this thing. It's it doesn't clip, it just holds. It's quite solid, so you don't lose anything. Uh, okay, so they tell you where to clip the sword. So basically, you can clip the sword. Um, there's the back of, sl of uh, slag. So you have a hole here. Sorry. And then you can put it... Over this pin, well, when it clips together properly. Where is it? There you go. 
Oh, that's a very tight fit. So you can store it there or here. There's a slot here and then there's a peg here and you can slot it in the back like that. Following that, they show you where to put it in the hand. So let's remove this one. So basically there's a, if you see the interior of the hand, which you don't because the pin is over it. There you go. You have a slot underneath all the joints for the fingers. So you take the sword handle and the sword handle, let me show you properly, has, you see those two things, uh, those two pins coming out of the handle. So you're going to put one inside the hand and it's not a super tight fit, but it works. Sorry, so you take, you see this slot here is similar to this slot here. And I'm guessing it's the same. Yeah, they work for both. So just kind of push it in there. Is there a left and right? All right, hold on. Oh, there we go. Wow, very tight fit. Ah, and I just removed the Grimlocks. All right, hold on. And the sword. Okay, it's still a core class Dinobot, you know, so it's a little fid fiddly. Oh, there you go. That's the look of Volcanicus with the upgrade. Of course, the swords are not holding right now. And I'm missing the crotch piece. So I'm going to guess that I missed a step. You see that mushroom peg right there? This thing here is going to plug right here. There you go. This is the complete Volcanicus upgraded. So you have the feet, the fist, and all the, well, the crotch piece. And then you have, this is fun. And then you have all the rest. So there you go. I'm going to take some pictures and show you better how it goes with some music. And, uh, you know, give you a good idea of uh, what it looks like. So, but thanks for watching this, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this. If you did, please like, subscribe, hit the bell. Also, leave a comment. Love reading those. Keep coming back. I have on the way. And remember, nothing in life gives you the right to be an asshole. Take care. Z bye bye. Z bye bye. He doesn't want to say he's mute. All right. Bye, guys.